Hello and welcome to another V-Ray feature short demonstration. In this video we'll demonstrate the V-Ray Clipper feature which performs render time sections, cutouts and booleans. The V-Ray Clipper is a geometry type object with a default shape of a plane. One of its sides has an arrow sticking out of it which indicates the cutting direction. What's more, it fills the gaps in the geometry left from the cutting. As a V-Ray 3.3, the V-Ray Clipper allows for using any solid, non-single-sided mesh. It's a shading effect which means that it doesn't modify the scene geometry. This makes it artifact and flicker-free when animated. Let's take a closer look at the V-Ray Clipper. This water mill has some objects inside. Let's use the V-Ray Clipper to remove the roof and take a look at the interior. It's created from the Geometry tab V-Ray category. By default, it's in planar mode. The section can be adjusted by positioning and rotating the V-Ray Clipper object. Currently, all scene objects are affected. To exclude some, for example the ground and the surroundings, click on the Exclude List button. In this case, there is a predefined selection set. Now, just the house is being cut. The gaps are filled with the default color of the clipper. To change the color, a new material can be applied on the V-Ray Clipper itself. However, the objects affected by the Clipper have different materials. To propagate them to the Clipper's filling, enable Use Object Material. As a V-Ray 3.3, the clipper could be set to mesh mode and use any solid mesh instead of a plane. This makes it suitable for render time boolean operations. Let's pick a custom made mesh. The exterior light from the sun is going through the clipped geometry. Most of the times this is desired. However, in this scene there is interior lighting present. To see only its effect and block any exterior lighting, disable the effect lights parameter. Similarly, the camera rays only uses the clipper only for the camera rays and ignores it for all secondary rays such as shadows, reflections in GI. Let's load up a more complex scene so we can see the updated V-Ray Clipper with Mesh Mode in action. In this short video tutorial we have covered the V-Ray Clipper feature in V-Ray together with its essential parameters for fine control such as exclude list, material options, mesh mode and affecting lights. I hope you have found this video useful and helpful. Make sure you check out more V-Ray feature videos. Thank you for watching.